Welcome to Factorio Train Megabase. My name is Nina, so this is episode 12 of our Let's Play campaign. So we are continuing. The robots are busy, so let them be busy all they want. What we're going to do today is continue working on whatever we find is least or is missing. And I think that's going to be sort of our philosophy moving forward is that we are just going to keep scaling things up and then find out what where the problems are. So in... Uh, in following that tradition, I'm simply going to scale up just like this. There we go. That is now scaling up by a lot our science. And now in order for us to figure out when, where, why we are running out of science. Hello train. And no. Oh, actually, we should uh, put in some trains. I wanted to do that. Ding, ding. Let's put in some trains. Right here. Oops. Uh, yeah, there's no one here. So, Oop. that's a tier one patron. Oh, all these beautiful captains of industry we have here. I'll take that one and I'll put it in here. So this is FB Kevy, very active in uh, on our little Twitch community as well. So uh, good to see that. Let's figure out what station this is. This is one one number four. All right. So something with four. One, one, number f Why are there 18 stations? That's not good. That's not good. That can't be the case. Oof. That's really bad. That's 17. So how can there be 18 stations? Right? Oh no. Oh no. How can there be one too many station? I wonder where number 18 is. Oh, dear. That's really straight. Oh, look, look. There's eight of these and eight of these, which kind of indicates to me that where that might be where one of those is. Do we have uh, the culprit up here? Maybe some copy paste error. Yeah. Ta-da! Damn, we're good. We're good. Uh, what should this one actually be? It's connected to that, so it should be connected to that one. Goes there. Did it change name? Two, two. Sweet. And now this one. Seventeen of each, and then there's nine plus eight. Ooh, that was good. And you are going to inactivity wait five seconds. Yes, but you are not going to be hooked up. So I'm going to try this and see if, okay, remember, hold shift and then go trains. Uh, no, like this. And it pops up. We get a name. Bigfoot 08. Thank you and welcome. Next is Kukarian, also very active in chat in Discord. What? Right, there we go. Nice to see the names that uh, it's Trigon. We'll also see some sometimes. Um, so it's it's the names I recognize the most are obviously the ones that are coming by in Twitch. So this is also for anyone who's because there's still people who are like, so you're streaming? Yes, I am. I'm streaming on Twitch pretty much every day. Three inches. Thank you. And Buddha. Um, so do drop by on Twitch, Luda. Five. I remember Luda several times from our uh, um, Darkest Dungeon campaigns. Hinka Pete. But maybe we know here. Thank you very much, everyone. It's so cool to see uh, the names here. Pulse and Kent Karma. Uh, I hope I don't see someone I, I just re re recently just uh, saw uh, cancel. And Aurelian. Also very often on Twitch as well. Yes. And Loki. And that's Command Delicious and Goji Porgy Porgy and there. Hi to Bat and Barry. And the last one we have for this run Kiln. Uh, Kiln or uh, Geraldine on Twitch. Good. So let's get these here and let's try to not be stupid. And by that I mean. 
select them in the row that so that behind us they will be active instead of in front of us. Oh, actually, it's easy to see. If they have this icon, they're active. And... Boom. Ooh, some of them actually just went out. Maybe that one just goes around. And they all have the icon. Great, so that's uh, this is awesome. Now we have more trains of the small ones. And the small ones will be the ones that are most busy. As you can see here, ha ha, hello. <clears throat> Uh, this one here, the recipe, it doesn't look quite as good as the other ones, but uh, it'll it'll be better. 135, I think we got enough of that. Uh, we don't have an, we have enough concrete, but we don't have any heavy concrete. So any little teeny tiny bit of heavy concrete that comes in will be picked up immediately. That's good news ish. Right, so we're gonna make another dashboard or another sort of visualization, which is gonna be um, hmm, different, I guess. That one. We are going to build another so in here this one is requester so in the what we're currently monitoring is what is in the network and by this one we can only see that that there is no blue in the network but we don't know if it's one two or seven train loads full that we would actually like so we don't know if we're just dipping down to zero or we are actually at minus 10. Uh, train loads and that's what we really want to get some kind of sense of and that's what we do here so a bit of copper a smidgen of copper I'll do the requester let's build that now it just annoys me that I didn't align it towards the same as my beautiful up here oh look at that it's actually, is it done with all of this? I'm just going to check. It looks like it. Nothing is being picked up. Nice. All right. Well, that's uh, that's good news. <clears throat> Let's start with this one. So this one is monitoring what? Ah. Ah, so now this is monitoring each network ID. Interesting. Can I then just do this one as goes like F, F, F. No, I can't do F. No, I can't do F. So what would be if I do three? That should be network one, t one and two. Is it? Yeah, this is number two, number four. Nothing to be requested number four, number eight. It's the liquid one. That's not correct though. I think using the liquid network. Let's just have a look because I think maybe a plastic one should be requesting it. Uh, let's see, where do we have plastic? That one. Oh, okay, that looks okay for now. Minus 97. Yeah, this is clearly... And you are in network 8. So... Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. So if I do number 9, that summarizes both 1 and 8 together. It's probably going to take a while to upgrade. Come on. Anytime now. There we go. So this style summarizes both... Yeah, okay. So this is basically just getting a number that is 2 to the power of... Yeah, 2 to the power of something minus 1. So if I say 2555, then it's basically all the networks up to 128 will be included. It's a bit weird way of doing it. As a programmer, it makes sense, but if I have for normal people, yeah, pff, or mathematicians. So this one summarizes all networks, which I, I think I want. Good. So let's, uh, from here on, uh, figure out what we want to display. I think we'll just try to do a display like this. Yeah. And. Yeah. Now what, do, 
<clears throat> what do we think will be missing? Hmm. Could also make... Wouldn't it be better to have it like... This is the amount of loads and then if it's red... Then the number of reds would be the number of loads that are missing. Yeah, I like that. Which is honestly just like this. Then everything becomes red. Take this. Oh, that didn't stick. Right, so we can always check this one to see what we're missing. Solar panels. Who the hell's requesting solar panels? All oh, right, the satellite production. And satellite production, yeah, no wonder that's been stuck. Um, so, 22,000 and there's 4,000. It says one, two, three, four, five. That actually seems weird, doesn't it? Yeah, 22,000. It is actually five loads. So, very clearly, you know, I don't think we actually need this. I mean, I think it's nice and all, but just hovering over this once in a while, we can just get a glance of it. Otherwise, I'd have to indicate every single one. Maybe it's actually better to just go like yellow and then have a separate line down here that goes red if there are negative, right? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's, let's, let's try this. Uh huh. Good old undo. Yeah, that's fine. And obviously this one I still need it. And... Yeah. This one is... Yeah, I'm just trying to be... What? There you go. So I think we need a separate one here. But there's room for another one. Ah, no. There's room for another one above it. So let's do that. Let's actually build it for one of those that we know is going to be missing. Like that one. So you're going to go here. That one is divided by minus. Yes. And the fact that it comes in here is actually not that one. It's coming from. Hmm, I built two. Oh, right. I actually had one in my inventory. Um, oh, this is going to be complicated. So let's do the green wire so I can almost keep track of this. Uh, so you now have an input, yes? And you're outputting A minus three. No, A3. And that goes now from here to that one. A4, if A is greater than Oh, I took it from the input, of course. The output, and there. And this one obviously should be red. It doesn't say how much, oops, how much is missing. It just says that something is missing. We can, of course, hover on this one. <clears throat> I, I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Um, I'm also kind of thinking that, you know, since there will be no negative, no, you know, I don't think I need it. Yeah? What if I do 
Now rem look at what is coming in here. None of these are negative and none of these are positive. Or this one says minus one, so it goes all. So now this one actually has a minus three out. So this one should just be if it is uh, less than or equal to minus one. Oh, it doesn't cut. It doesn't. Uh, this one goes here, right? And it should go like that. I like. That's actually quite clever. And then it goes out to say minus six. Hmm. I like. Okay, I don't like. Oh, please. That means there's a negative, and then we could just hover here and see that it says minus six, and that, that'll be fine. At least we can see that it's actually actively negative things. And then I guess we might also want to sort of hmm, manipulate the numbers, you could say. Actually, it's that one. And I don't want this one. I do want this, but I don't want that. There. Yeah. So if we take this thing out and go this thing, it should have worked, but also needs this, which I didn't get. Okay, why is there a green going? Uh, the green one is actually not supposed to be there. And yeah, okay. Ah, uh, why do we now have that? Let's do... There. This... This one we can do, and they are all there. So now if I take this, I think we're gonna be fine. All right, so now it's the one, two, three, four, and this one says if it's greater than or equal to five. Yes, I like this. This gives us a actually a much better indicator. I like it, then we don't have the red stuff. Yeah, I like it, I like it, and it's, it's good. Um, we are definitely going to make more of these than But, sorry, but why is... Oh, that's to the raw materials. The other ones are coming from there. Hmm, okay. So... If... We actually need to take all of this out. Copy these two together. Yes. Take all this crap. And go up. Yeah. Get one more, like so. And then all we need is love, as always. Doesn't work. All right, we'll find out why. Once we build it, this one outputs minus 21,000. This one inputs. It doesn't input this one. Ah, they are not connected like this. Really? Now it's aligned. Okay. Did they? Oh, yeah. That's actually a bad way. That should not be like this. That should be like this. Okay. Hold on. How did... How did that happen? This is requesting minus 35. This one is available with 26. And now they just subtract each other. Uh, I don't know. Uh, is that correct? Why? No processing unit found. That's kind of okay. Now at this point, it's not requesting it. Oh, okay. So it's going to be a short temporary thing where I don't have it. Look at that. We actually have enough of these. And this one's... I like this way more. Way more. And it's easy to do. So let's, uh, let's do that. Off you go. And all of this. Yeah. 
all it requires is looking these up. So I intend to continue to build, to expand this dashboard so that we can later on figure out, okay, why? Okay, so there's no one requesting this. Hmm. How can we have no one requesting any? Yes, that that seems weird, right? How much you got? You got uh, minus four and a half thousand. Is it? Oh no, it's not working. I'm an idiot. There we go. No wonder we're not get straining our base if we don't build that. Silly me. Sorry about that. I was just when I was building all of that. Uh, the menial tasks. I didn't want to have the science just chugging along. So I uh, temporarily disabled it, which obviously, yeah. Now we could do more of these, like go this way and show how many lines there are. But the fact that it just says like, there is a negative supply, yes negative supply of rocket control units. Then we can hover over and set two loads full. Mm -hmm. Negative there, two loads full. And this one, there is no negative supply. It just doesn't have any supply. It doesn't have a supply, but it doesn't need anything to it. There's a distinct difference between this and this. This one, we don't have to worry about. We don't even have to look at it. It might be like, yeah, if there's nothing red. So our objective now is just looking at the red ones and just make them go away, especially when it comes to like, we can definitely do more of this. Let's do that. Let's take a look at that one first. Okay, so that's one beacon off. This one, you're just not good enough, are you? Are you working? Yeah, you're working. And that goes... That's just a single input. Uh, all it needs is a bit of water. So we need a single, in single input, but with water. Oh, that could be like a million places. Alright, we'll take these with us so that... And let's just build it like further out. So that, something like this. This is a bad one anyway because we have that. So we just uh, hook it here. That's good. We can also extend it, but I don't think that's necessary. And we take here. We take, let's just take all of it. Uh, you know, do I want, do I dare go there? <laughs> That's the next part. Here. And that just fits right in, except that one and that one are not connected. Hmm. Someone is cheating with, cheating us or someone forgot to get everything. Good. Now the one thing we're missing is a water supply. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, bling bling. However, this though is totally not necessary. And I can take this one out and put it here instead. And there. Good old autosave. Saves us from bad stuff. Oh, look at that. And you should now be mm, actually two, and this one should be two, which means this one should be one now that I changed the names. Oh. One. So these ones are one, and this one down here is two. This is going to make lighter, lighter, yeah. We can even we can easily build it bigger, but uh, don't know, don't know. We'll we'll take it like this. That's gonna be the heavy oil coming in. That's a lot of heavy oil. Nothing coming in here, obviously. This one, it is like it is, and I think. Oh, hold on, it's not even powered. There, that's important. Right, that was uh, actually really simple. But the next thing is we have to look at this one. Is this good enough? You know. Being of good enough. I can take this part out. Yes. Then I can take uh, this part and just go like that. 
I could even go one more further just to illustrate a point. Then I'll go to this one. Yeah. There you go. That one is not necessary. That one's not necessary. This one is necessary. That one. There, so now we just extended it. Oh. And I can do here, take the last one, and we can actually do the same up on, let's say, the original, which means I just take this part out, anything that sort of deviates, and then I superimpose the new one on top. And it's good, it works. That should. <clears throat> Then we just need more of this. This is also a good one because it also only needs one. And this one should have another name. This should should be called Recipe Light Oil Cracking. And then B1. That one. Recipe. Cool. Light oil cracking. Now this should be easy to build. I am even, you know what? I'm actually going to do this, this whole damn thing. Boom. It just, again, single input with water on the side. That's single input with water on the side. <laughs> Sounds like I'm at a restaurant. There, single input, water on the side. That one, is that actually okay? Nope, it's everything except okay. And I will take one more of those. Please don't let them be. I'll do that, I'll do that. Okay. And now we have an active demand here. That could be from sulfur, that could be from yeah, it could be from anything. And this one. And this one just gets built. If we have these. So let's uh, let's try and see if we can... These are really important to get. Once we get that. So this is... I love this. I love how easy it is to build now. And this one, once they're built, that one should now be number two. And as soon as it... Pops into number two, it should start working. Whoops. Uh, that one. There we go. Now we are actively using our dashboard to tell us what to do next. And that's where we're going to continue to go. So next one, it tells us to do blue circuits. What we also should make a dashboard for is the number of trains available in each of the different networks. That would actually be a nice thing to do. Let's, uh, let's try to figure out how to do that for next time so that we can get some kind of sense of how many trains do we actually have available. That would be nice. Anyway, we've changed our dashboard. I like it. It's much better now, I think. And that one also needs to be changed, but that's uh, that's easy. Anyway, time for us to wrap up. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you're enjoying this as we progress and continue the expansion. And uh, now we got a lot of solar panels through here and there. Yeah, that's the that's what happens when you do that. Never mind. Yeah, okay. So thank you for joining. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Until then, take care and stay effective.